Thank you, Amelia. St. Louis Circuit Attorney Kim Gardner has to respond by today to the legal filing of Missouri Attorney General Andrew Bailey. Fox 2's Chris Renier is downtown with what could happen later today. We are outside of Gardner's office here at the Carnahan Courthouse. A source telling me that Gardner does plan to respond in detailed fashion today to the filing by Missouri AG Andrew Bailey. A judge has weighed in saying last month that if Gardner does not respond by today's deadline, then she could face a judgment by default. Bailey initially called on Gardner to resign in the wake of the horrible crash last month downtown that resulted in 17-year-old Janae Edmondson of Tennessee losing her legs. When Gardner refused to step down, Bailey filed a motion called Quo Warranto to try and remove Gardner from office. Bailey's motion accuses Gardner of neglecting her job in multiple ways, including failing to prosecute cases, failing to keep in contact with victims, and failing to review and file cases submitted by St. Louis police. Gardner, though, has fired back, saying Bailey's accusations are politically motivated and that she is doing her job correctly. Gardner's supporters have also spoken out, saying that she is the victim of what they call racist attacks and illegal lynching. The controversy over Gardner intensified after the crash involving Janae Evanson. The driver of the car who police say caused the crash, 21-year-old Daniel Riley, was out on bond on a pending robbery case when the crash occurred. He had violated his bond conditions multiple times without any consequences. Some have blamed Gardner for Riley not being back behind bars before the crash. But Gardner says she verbally requested that Riley's bond be revoked three times and judges did not act. We will see what today brings. Reporting downtown, I'm Chris Fernier.